Good morning, everyone. Welcome to the beautiful Texas Gulf Coast. Today, we're gonna try to get a few hours of fishing in before the rains that are predicted start falling down on us pretty hard. We've got some high southwest winds. I'm gonna cover quite a bit of water as fast as I can. We've got the first lure tied on. Let's get started and see what happens. I attempt for flounder against the rocks. Eh, it didn't work. Let's uh, put this away and uh, we'll go with something that swims at the top right here. I've been seeing a few blow ups, small ones, but I'd like to know what they are. We'll see if we can get something to bite this fella. Idiot. Bro, that is my lure, you crazy. It's not enough cloud cover to drown out that sun, so more than likely not gonna work. I'll go subsurface with a little wake bait. My last cast right there with the paddle tail. We've been at it for an hour and 20 minutes, not one bite. I've got one more lure to go through and I've went through every setup that I've had pre-tied. And even though we got the structure out here by way of these rocks, uh, not one flounder, speckled trout or redfish. Sheep's head love these things as well and not even one of those guys. So uh, we'll throw the shrimp Let's see if that's going to be able to get it done for us. If not, we'll uh, take this as a sign that they're just really not out here. And if they are, which I'm thinking they are, they don't want to bite right now. Let's go at them with the shrimp. It's been hot all week long. Today's video is sponsored by CatchCo. The lures that we are using can be found on the Carl's website. If you're interested, go down into my video description below, click on the link and it's gonna bring you here to the Carl's website where you can check out the Skelly Shrimp. It's a collaboration lure between CatchCo and Salt Native. And if you think about making a purchase, I highly encourage you to become a member. You're gonna be able to take advantage of up to 30% off savings from the site you're going to get free shipping on most items. There's tackle insurance and a whole lot of other perks that are available to members only. Thank you, CatchCo, for sponsoring today's video. Now let's get back to the action. Hopefully it'll stay hot. There we go. Oh my gosh.
It's barely hooked. Oh. Heart is pounding. Look at that garbage. <laughs> right there, yo. Let's let her breathe, catch her breath after that bite. The hook just fell right out. Oh. Thank goodness I was running two cameras because the hat cam, I don't know what it did, it bugged out on me and it didn't capture any of that footage. But at least we have the other angle. Oh, I wish I would have captured the fight on this one though. That is a 25 and three quarter inch speckled trout. All right, sweetheart, are you ready to go? There's no way that I would harvest something this big. Well, she's gonna be a breeder, swimming all on her lonesome. let you go on this side <sighs> that right there just made my day if I don't get anything else for the remainder being that the bite is so slow that one right there we made it count Texas City of all places who would have thought this salt native shrimp right here has been putting in overtime. The thing has just been magical for me for the past week or so, being able to get that bite. If you've never tried one of these, I highly encourage you to do so. That pure prawn color. Fish may not be attracted to a certain color, who knows, but the confidence that I have in this particular lure and the color pattern that it's in, woo, it's off the charts right now. There we go. little undersized fella. Ooh, barely had him hooked too. Not bad. That's very worrisome. Got a big old gray cloud right in front of us. I'm turning on the juice because I don't want to get caught inside that. Let's take a look at the radar. Yeah. I hope I can trust my weather apps. Last time I did, we got poured down on like crazy, but that cloud right up there is uh, very worrisome. We'll continue fishing and if we see lightning, then uh, yeah, we're gonna get out of Dodge. Yeah, I don't know about that. Let's just get out of here. That weather app must not be seeing what I'm seeing. 
I tell you what, I do not chase after trophies, but it feels so darn good whenever you get lucky enough to catch one. Thanks so much for stopping by today. If you enjoyed the video, don't forget to hit that thumbs up button. For those of you not subscribed to the channel and you enjoyed what you saw, do me a favor, click the subscribe button and ring the notification bell icon so that YouTube will notify you whenever I drop a new video. I'm also on Patreon, so for those of you that want behind the scenes content, go over there, see if it's for you. And if you're gonna make a visit to the Texas Gulf Coast, the upper portion that is, then my fishing reports there on Patreon may help you out to speed that learning curve. Until next time, tight lines, y'all.